Hey guys, it's Shay from Polygon Motion, and welcome to this short tutorial. In this tutorial, we're going to create a full moon, vector moon in After Effects without using any type of image, completely in After Effects, in a very short amount of time uh, and procedural. So, we're going to create this kind of moon in After Effects. As you can see, we have a full moon in here with some animation of fractaling and things like that. And it's looking very cool. And we can use that in some infographics videos, some, some explainer videos, some Halloween videos, because Halloween is coming in the next two weeks. And maybe you are creating some kind of skies and happy Halloween promos and things like that. Maybe some of you guys ask why we have to create this in Alpha Effect while well, we can use some image from Google and things like that. The cool thing is it's procedural. You can change animation of these fractaling and things like it to look more real realistic. And the other cool thing is that it's completely vector. If you change the scale of it, if you change, if you want to create a 4K promo, it is looking fine looking crispy sharp and if you want to just scale it down or up it doesn't matter you have to you do you doesn't have to think about that because of this is a cool way to just put two minutes and you are done okay guys let's create a composition new composition in here full HD full moon two and what I'm going to do in here is just uh, create a new solid control Y and call this BG. It would be our sky, something like that. Night sky for night sky. I'm going to use grand unit ramp and choose radial. Put this in here and make this black and a bit like this, like a dark night like a scary Halloween nights <laughs> so here's our sky and uh, let's uh, create uh, choose ellipse tool and by holding shift you can create a pixel perfect uh, circle like this and put this in here change the color to white or maybe a little bit grayish like this. Now it is our moon. We're finished. <laughs> I'm just joking. We are not finished. We have to put some glowing effect for this. Type glow. Just drop it on this. Now you see it's a little bit cooler, but we have to adjust the intensity of glow and radius and things like that. And also we can change some color in glow color choose a and b color change this to a little bit uh, bluish color like blue and glow and like that so now let's create some mappings and fractals in here to make it a little bit uh, natural like this and what I'm going to do in here is we're using fractalize effect create a solid in here fractal and type uh, uh, fractalize in effects and preset drop it in here and play with some brightness and contrast like this and go to transform scale it down a little bit up and this and uh, in evolution for, for creating some animation type time and 100 maybe or 50 like this you see so there is some animation going on here and uh, just pre con this call this fractal and put the blending option, blending mode to add and scale it down 
to just match the size of our moon. And now let's duplicate this and put it above this and change the tracking math to alpha math. And what I'm going to do in here is you see that there is some glow in here. In this moon, just delay this glow for our alpha channel. And uh, in moon, let me change the color of it a little bit to see the actual uh, fractal in here. Also playing with our glue in here to make it stand out like this. And also just fading this away. And you can see that you can change the fractal position like this, whatever you want, or maybe scale it up a little bit like this. And you see that. And just trying to and what I'm going to do in here is just duplicate this moon and change the glow, delete the glow, fast blur and blur it out a little bit like this and make this maybe a little bit bluish type put underneath of this and put this in add to a blending option to add Like this and now you see that we have just create a very nice moon so create a controller null object can uh, parent them all to this null object now you can put this moon in here and start creating some stars maybe you can create the stars as well just control Y let me show you guys as well particles uh, CC particle particle world and just uh, of these grets we don't need them producer just to reduce let me just change this to quarter two nice speed like this and change the animation gravity to zero we don't have gravity in stars and resistance like this now you see that it's acting like stars and go to particles change this to stars change the color to white both color to white and max opacity like this and maybe a little bit just shrink down the velocity and now you have this kind of things. You can create some cool uh, animation and uh, scenes like this. So that was it. Hope you guys enjoyed from this tutorial. And if you enjoyed, please don't forget to subscribe to Polygon Motion channel and put your comments. And if you have any suggestion or question, feel free to reach me out. And my name is Yashayur and see you guys next time.